I am here with Mr. Beatermatch. Mr. Beatermatch, how are you? Oh, I'm great, thank you. Yeah? So you had a walk around Coventry, uh, and how did you find it? How did you like it? I, I like it. Yeah. I, I'm not saying that. I mean, you know, it's concrete. It's, it's, it's a lot of I, find, I find it interesting, I do. I like the ring road, you can just sort of come off and it's anywhere. Go you, right, people have been stuck on there for years. So you've, uh, you've been to Coventry more than once, you said before. I mean, yes. how, how do you find the crowds here? Do you enjoy it? Always been a good one here, yeah. actually. Yeah, I played Freshers at this uni as well, and that was a great gig. Yeah, we love a bit of Freshers, we do. I'm a second year, so I have one more Freshers. Think about playing next year, maybe? You know, did you do it? Did you yeah, do it? never know. The you stuff coming know. in, so I'll see, see where it ends up. So you are a DJ remix, producer, artist, everything. You do a lot. Is there, how did it start? How did it begin? How did, where did you, you know, lightning bolt, let's do that. Um, it's weird, I started as a turntablist, then became like a kind of normal club DJ doing normal residencies. And then after doing that for a few years, a lot of people were sort of saying, why are you still doing this? Because I scratch and mix. Yeah. Um, and then I suddenly thought, you know what? I think video might be the way to go. It's going to be more it's obvious what I'm doing. Video. You can scratch in film clips. And it's, it was like that. It just seemed a natural progression of my style of DJing. So. Uh, about two and a half years ago, I just started to go down the video route, and it's taken really taken off since. I mean, I, I saw you setting up. It seems very, very technical. It seems like there's a lot involved with the screens, and then how you were doing it, I don't know. I mean, I have a little bit of knowledge about how you're doing the video, and it just seems incredible. Yeah. But I mean, for you, obviously, you use a lot of artists in some of your music and in your mixes. I mean, is there anyone that you wouldn't work with? Is there someone that you refuse to work with if you could? No, no. It's um, it's all fair game because you can put your own twist on it, and you know, turn it into what you want. So. You know, to then. anything, so you could use just open-minded, really. Yeah, yeah. And uh, the twist question which uh, was asked is, um, if there was artist, if there was an artist, DJ, musician, singer, is it, who would it be? Who would you work with? Anyone in the world? Um, yeah, well, well, a long-term hero has been Jazzy Jeff from, you know, when I started DJing. I'm yeah. inspired by his mixing and, you, you know, his set now is still awesome. It's technically amazing what he does with his scratching and how he puts a set together, so... I'd love to work with Jesse Jeff. Well, mate, who knows? Mm. Okay, well, thank you. Well, we look forward to seeing you tonight, and uh, I'm very excited. I'm going to come watch your set. Thank you. Looking thank forward you to it much. myself. Yeah, cheers. cheers.